hands off, Rocky. I called dibs on the last soda. Oh, yeah, after I saw it first. Well, it's got my name all over it. Last time I checked, your name wasn't Scuzzy Cola. Uh -huh. Give it. You give it. It's mine. No, mine. <laughs> Let go. No way. Uh-oh. Hey, who turned off the lights? I am mucho afraid of the dark. Hey, Ricardo. How's a new job? It's a living, my footlong friend. How do you like that? Ricardo hopped on the soda. Quit slacking, Ricardo. I'm paying you to do odd jobs. The odder, the better. Not to stand around blabbing with Riff Raff. Now get to work. <laughs> Baroom! Ricardo, stick your tongue on that fly zapper. Thank you, but no. I'm on a strict no insect diet. Do it or you're fired. Very well. Since you asked me so nicely. Ah, 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 yeah. ah, did I say fired? I meant fried. I dropped a tooth in there. Find it for me. As you wish, boss. Blah. Hey, what is this? A blotto ticket? Perhaps my lock is about to change. Huh? Blotto, blotto ticket? ticket? Mine. Oh, mine. Give that. You give it. Actually, the ticket is mine. You see, the finder is the keeper, and the losers are the weepers, who get fired and flushed. <laughs> to scan or not to scan? That is the million dollar blotto ticket question. What are you waiting for, Ricardo? You want to be a squishy toilet brush for the rest of your life? Blessed mamacita of chance! My ticket is the big winner! Oof! Mm, mm, mm. I am no longer what the poets call flat broke. Enough celebrating! Now that you're filthy rich, you gotta learn how to look and act rich and filthy! And I'm just a classy guy to show you how it's done. For starters, you're way too pale. Wealthy folks love their fake tastes. Hmm, this tan does not smell fake. It smells banana-y. Whoops, better turn up the heat. We're late for your hair appointment. But I do not have hair. You do now. <laughs> no, not even. Oh, boy. <laughs> Uh-uh. Perfect! Some unnatural color, and a spritz to achieve maximum helmet hair. A tornado couldn't undo that, too. As I always say, the peel makes the banana. Uh -huh. I'm in my banana birthday suit! Hey, who is this dashing fruit, and what has he done with Ricardo? Now for the icing on the cake, aftershave. I mixed it myself out of prune juice, pine air freshener, and rusty pipe water. Oh, yes. I positively reek of success. I am a new banana. Now, big on, ah. peasants. I am too rich to associate with the likes of you. I taught him everything he knows. So proud. <laughs> The frosty slopes of frozen TV dinners. Soak up the sun under a blazing tropical heat lamp. Gaze upon the most gl gl glittery jewelry in the entire Yucky Mart. But that's nothing compared to the squishy towers. A colossal condo of double ply toilet paper. Or the double squish ranch and its herd of thoroughbred race roaches. W welcome to lifestyles of the rich and the disgusting. I'm your host, Serge. All these wonders are owned by the world's richest banana, Ricardo. His peel to riches tale is the stuff of legend. Join me now for a peek at R Ricardo's high-priced, trend-setting lifestyle. Ah, muy picante. Let the interview begin. Ricardo, you live a life of glitzy gluttony. What more could an overripe tropical fruit ask for? Excellent question, my television companion, but definitely not my real life friend. What more could I ask for? Hey, how about my pedicure over here? Right away, boss. Gotta keep those rich, rich tootsies trimmed. <laughs> I have many rich banana things to do, but still I stay in touch with the little people. 
like this ever ripening fellow. Don't give me that hoity toity fancy talk. I was rich before your bunch even fell out of the tree. <laughs> I had it all friends, music, and all the stale chocolate coins you could eat. <laughs> but I lost it all. Betrayed by my best pal and my best gal. <laughs> what I'm saying is, don't trust nobody. Excellent advice. Everybody out! <laughs> Too bad, so sad. Come back when you're rich like me. I'm not sure that's the moral of my story. Or is it? for this squishy banana to get his beauty sleep. But first, I must make sure my many millions are safe and snug. Buying up all the Bloto tickets proves I have a brilliant banana business brain. One of them is sure to be another big winner. But I shall save that pleasure for tomorrow. Now, to activate the alarm, and then off to Betty Buy I go. <sighs> it is good to be wealthy. Sweet dreams, Banana Mush. When you wake up, all those sweet blotto tickets will be mine. Hey, hey! You mean ours, right? Uh, sure. That's what I meant. Hmm. I got moldy cherry. Hmm. Oh, dusty mint and roach droppings. Are you sure this is safe? Nope. Ah! Quiet! <laughs> Go! Here, boy. Oh, here, the chewing is. Oh. Time for plan B. What plan B? Take the tickets and run. Halt, you ticket thieves, or face my tropical banana fury. Eat hot potato with no butter or sour cream. Ow, ow, I'm the more of an onion ring guy. Stolen my precious Bloto tickets and ignited my fiery banana rage! <laughs> Time for us to banana split! Ricardo's gone crazy! I know, right? It's positively shocking! We're trapped! But I'm not going down without a fight! What do you know? This flat battery still has some juice! You sure do, Serge! <laughs> but I got all the blood on tickets! <laughs> Never trust a fully loaded sub! They always want uh, everything on it! Those tickets are mine! Actually, the tickets are mine! Finders keepers, losers weepers! Perhaps. But I assure you I will not be the one weeping, my footlong friend. Oh, yeah? Well, we'll, we'll, we'll see about that. Give me those Give me tickets. Ouch! My head! Oh, ah. oh, I am coming for you, my precious. Oh, no, you don't. They are all winners and all mine. All ours! Oh, oh. 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 Stinky? How dare you slam my own gates in my own handsome banana face? Ain't yours anymore, bub. You flat busted. But I used that chocolate coin you gave me to scratch and win a blotto ticket that fell right out of the sky. Now all of you dead beats are working for me. Come on, you lazy slow pokes. I hired you to bob for toilet pennies, and that's what you're gonna do. Eh, it's a living. Ready, Rocky? Let's do this! 
人哉！The one multiplied by the tuna's expiration date, you get twenty points. No star record. I am the greatest fried dessert that ever lived, and the only. Oh, me next! I'm gonna set a record for uh, falling on your face. Huh? <laughs> no. What I meant was, hey, what's that smell? Ew! It's me! A oh, rag! Need a rag! Uh, ah. What's going on? Oh, that's the store's health department sticker. This is the rag. Who turned out the lights? I'll fight you! No one turns up eggheads! Oh! Ow! Hey! Ow! What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, Egghead, but you gotta admit, that was hilarious. Egghead, where did he go? Egghead! Egghead! Egghead? Hey! Egghead! Come back! Yeah! We're sorry, buddy! We didn't mean to laugh at you! Where are you? According to my calculations, he could be... Anywhere. Watching a rabid raccoon devour a rotten cantaloupe in the alley? Witnessing a flock of pigeons poop on cars from the window? Gazing at the majesty of dead rats floating through the sewer? I'm not dumb! I'm not! There's nothing but smarty pants thoughts rumbling around in this old noggin boy! Nothing but... Ooh, hey, it means... It's mine! Come back! Minty, 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 minty! Oh! Ah! 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 Got some in my mouth! Oh no, my feet! Don't worry, Minty! I'll save you! Ah. Looks like I need something long and pointy to get you out! <laughs> Only a smart guy would think of that! But what? Of course! My tongue! Who's the stupid one now? Oh. I feel unexpectedly invigorated! What an odd sensation! My brain synapses are firing at an unprecedented rate! I've become super intelligent! My goodness! Even a person of half my IQ could see this establishment is in clear violation of over 538 health codes. 539! There's one thing to do. It's my duty as a responsible citizen to ensure that this store is shut down and condemned. Immediately! I've become aware of a disturbingly large number of health code violations at this grocery establishment. These include, but are not limited to, a faulty air conditioning unit. A cockroach community using the hot buffet as their playground. And graveyard. <laughs> I trust you will act swiftly to shut this store down for good. Observantly yours, Egghead E. Edgerton, Esquire. There. Now to drop this missive in the mail and wait for this ghastly place to be condemned. Egghead, we're looking for you. Come and help us out. Great ghastly gases. What are you doing? We noticed this jar cracked, stinking, and leaking. So naturally, we decided to play with it. Awesomest water slide ever! That's not water, it's spoiled salsa! Huh? Well, it explains the smell and the corn. Ho <laughs> ho! Salsa slide! Uh, excuse me, I 
have somewhere else to be. Anywhere else, in fact. Suit yourself! Ready, Rocky? Born ready! Whoa! Tuna bunga! Oh, my. Thankfully, once I mail this letter to the health department, this whole place will be shut down. In you go. Did he say what I think he said? Get him! Oh, dear. Yeah! <laughs> No one insults Yakimar! This place is paradise! Ah! 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 My letter! Ha! I tore it up! In your face! Yakimar is safe for all time! Huh? You realize I can simply write another one? Oh. Well, crud! Now, if you'll excuse me, I have another letter to write! With at least 60 more violations to report. 61. Buddy, pal, you really want all your friends kicked out on the street? Well, I've never been out there, but I can only assume that the street is safer and less disgusting. So, yes, I'm only helping you, Rocky. My newfound intelligence has shown me the way. Huh, what makes you think you're so smart? We've already got a super genius, Doc Brock! Ah, that's where I left that peppermint stick. Of course! Doc Brock! Egghead, I'll make a deal with you. You prove that you're smarter than Doc Brock, and you can do whatever you want. But if he proves smarter than you, you promise to quit this letter stuff for good. Agreed. But how do we determine which of us is smarter? Well, naturally, by the most civilized scientific way possible. What's that? Slushy Donkey Contest! Ah, no! All set up here, Pizza Face! Great, Rocky! Okay, to recap, we're about to find out who is a bigger genius, the amazing Doc Brock, or naturally smart... Hmm. Always green. All right, who zapped his brain by sticking his tongue in a wall outlet and now thinks he's a genius. I am a genius! Now, to test who's smarter beyond any possible doubt, we're, of course, using the most scientific method ever devised. The Donkey Contest. Yeah! yeah, brilliant. The loser falls in neon-colored sludge, probably never to return. Winner gets cake. Mmm, cake. I love science. Ahem, the winner, me, also is permitted to contact the health department to close the Yucky Mart forever. Boo! Oh. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Let the testing begin. Yeah! yeah. Oh, merciful milk mold. IQ question number one, Egghead. What do you get when you cross a brontosaurus with fireworks? What do you get when you cross a... That's just a riddle from a gum pack. Wrong! The answer is dynamite. <laughs> get it? Rocky, if you will. Ugh, you're insane. Thank you. Next question, Doc Brock. How do you make a tissue dance? Ha! Just put a little boogie in it. <laughs> yeah. Correct. Egghead, what did one hat say to the other? This is totally unfair. Nope, the hat said, you stay here, I'll go on ahead. Rocky, cut two spaghettis for that terrible answer. You got it. What? Doc, why did the toad cross the road? To prove he had guts. <laughs> yes. This is madness. Egghead's turn. What's invisible and smells like carrots? Police. Wrong. Bunny farts! <laughs> nice try, though. Bye-bye now! Oh, help! Help! Someone save me! Relax, Piggy. It's just slushy. It'll be cool and refreshing. 
Oh, or not? Yeah, great Humpty Yoke! I'm freaking seeing Yoke! Oh. oh my gosh! I know! He even screams in fancy words! Big jabbers and thunderations! I got this! Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Long on heroics! Bit short on aim! Come on! We'll save you guys! Start pouring liquid onto an electrical appliance and save them. Oh, good great. Has no one ever heard of an off switch? Geronimo! Oh. Ha! You're both alive! Yeah, that rolling thingy blew. Egghead, did you just say blue? No. You used the one syllable word. You're dumb again. Awesome. What's a syllable? Yeah! yeah! And you don't want to shut down the Yucky Mart anymore? Shut it down! I'd never want to shut down my yummy, smelly, gooey, hairy house in Moldy Fun! Did I say hairy? Yeah! yeah! And we love you, man. Just the idiotic way you are. Really? Ugh. Give me a big guy. Rocky, Rocky, are you okay? Rocky? Well, who's that? And who are all of you? Who are we? We're your best friends in the world. Oh, really? Well, I swear I've never seen you before in my life. Or my name isn't Katie Harry. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa!